Hello and welcome to week three of monetizing my small YouTube channel. As you can see, I'm down on the beach again. I've just been for a swim. It's about eight o'clock in the morning and it's a beautiful day. And um, yeah, I'll turn around so I've got the sea behind me. I can't see anything now, but um, yeah, so week, week three, so it's been a bit of a emotional time, <laughs> as anything is when you're trying out something new, dealing with tech issues. This gimbal thing that I'm filming with, holding my phone has been like a nightmare, but I'm not giving up. But I successfully managed to edit for my first video this week, which was my vlog that went out um, on Wednesday. And it took, I think, three or four goes to upload it to YouTube. It was having trouble processing it. I don't know what was going on, but it worked eventually. Um, I know my editing's not great. <laughs> I got a comment from somebody in one of my videos about um, the quality of my videos and the thumbnails and then looked at their channel. They'd not made a single video. But, you know, one of my mentors says you're always going to get critics and haters and actually they're your biggest fans because <laughs> they're watching your videos. <laughs> so that I thought that was, that was quite funny, actually. And, you know, You've probably heard the saying done is better than perfect you have to keep going and you get better at it like i'm getting more of the hang of, of using this thing i think at the beginning it was just overwhelming and so i just made a commitment that i'm going to use it a little bit each day and just get used to the features don't need to try and do anything fancy so now i know how to get it to track my face so when i move my head it moves around and follows me i can change it from selfie view to yeah so that is the view that I'm looking at here how beautiful is that that is like come back to me although that view is probably better isn't it <laughs> I live about one minute walk that way how blessed am I so I can just come down here have a swim and I did actually go back home and get my phone because I thought actually this is a perfect time to film so yeah, it's been quite an emotional week as well. I've had a bit of comparisonitis as well. When you look at other YouTube channels, you think, why have they got so many subscribers and I haven't? And I lost a few. <laughs> and then of course that's, like, I mustn't get attached to that. And then remembering, well, actually if I've lost a few subscribers, well then they weren't the right people for me. And actually I've gained a lot more. So, you know, you win some, you lose some so it does feel like sometimes it's two steps back then three steps forward another two steps back but as long as it's going in the right direction so my hours are increasing my view time and so it's it, as i say it's all going in the right direction and it's just being able to go through that but as you know if you're here on my channel that i also teach meditation and do eft which helps to manage um, deal with all you know the difficult emotions I've got those tools to be able to deal with it and just to stay present and know that this isn't going to um, last forever that it will change and I just have to keep going I mean I set up this YouTube channel I think it said 2016 and it has evolved and changed over that time and I was watching a, a video the other day saying um, you don't necessarily know your niche when you start, start out. When I first started out, it was for teachers because I was a teacher. Then I realised that most teachers aren't interested in self-development. Um, and I focused on doing the guided meditations and then through you keep following the breadcrumbs and then eventually discover that there's not much content out there for women of, of my age, over 60. Um, I'm 60, nearly 61 at the time of filming this and people want it and also I was looking for videos about what you know picking your life up again after hitting rock bottom and when I searched that on YouTube all the videos that came up were made by men so I think well, where's the content for women and and reading comments on other people's videos and then thinking oh well there's already people doing it but everybody's story is unique 
I was inspired by Silva and Solo, but her life is, although she's, she's a little bit younger than me, but her life is very different to mine. Yeah, we're both solo women, but I've got children, I've been divorced, I've been in an abusive marriage, and I've got a son with addiction problems and all this other stuff going on which is very different to other people's experiences. So we all have a valuable story to tell. We all have um, our wisdom to share. So um, I'm going to go back to the studio now and, um, and, and show you the stats for this week. Um, so thank you for following and please subscribe if you haven't already. Um, help me grow those views and subscribers because I need well, you can get, you can join the partner program when you've got 500 subscribers and I think 3,000 hours of views in the last year at some level. And then there's another level at 1,000 subscribers and 4,000 hours of watch time in the last year. And that's when you can start earning money from, from the adverts, which are, re and also another reason I want to do that as well as um, boosting my retirement income, I also would like to uh, be able to control where I put the adverts in my videos. So when I'm recording guided meditations, you don't want adverts coming up in the middle of those. And I, and it, once they get more views, YouTube show the adverts anyway. <laughs> so, um, and I've got no control at the moment where they go. Uh, so, so yeah, that's another good reason to do it, to have more agency and more control o over your channel as well, of course, of getting paid because um, I don't have a huge pension um, and I'm due to, re I reach retirement age in the UK 67 at the moment, so that's a little over six years for me. I'm just going to walk down to the sea now and take some pictures of the sea to show you how it's beautiful and clear. It's Oh, actually, I can see my friend swimming. She might not want me filming her. But anyway, um, yeah, so I'll go to the stats. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next week. Hi, so here we are looking at the analytics. And I thought I'd come out do this bit outside. because I thought, oh, it's not sunny. So I'll be able to see my screen. And then, of course, the sun decides to come out, but I can just about see it. Right, so we've had a bit of growth this week, and it's each week it's growing more than the previous week. So I think making content, talking more about my life, and particularly um, aimed at women sort of my sort of age, and judging by some of the comments I've received on my video, I'm starting to to sort of reach, reach that target um, audience. Um, but, you know, I'm not particularly saying I, I'm looking for a niche, but I just believe we attract people on the same vibration who, who are like us, don't we? We want people that we relate to. So I'm probably not going to be very relatable to teenage boys, for example. So anyway, let me share my screen and let's look at the numbers. Uh, there we go. Share. Right. So the views have gone up now from, I've just got my numbers here from last week, so I, I don't forget them. Uh, it was, so last week was 344, and now we're at um, 357. So that's like gone up by one more than last week. As I said earlier, I did lose a couple of subs subscribers this week, but that's fine. And the number of hours has also gone up by a little bit less than last week, um, from 376 to 399. So it's, it's going in the right direction. So we can't really complain. I've also made some changes to my channel. I, I was looking at last week's video to see what the, to get the numbers. And then I realized I said I was going to change the description because I changed the name last week. So I've changed the description now to see if that makes a difference um, to say more what it's about rather than what I'm posting. I've also changed the layout on the home page. I put a video, a featured video for re for new sub new subscribers, that is people who haven't subscribed before. There's also a video that I've been doing for a while now for returning subscribers. 
Um, and then I've also put all the, I did a bit of research on how to change the layout because I had all the uh, playlists listed one by one. So now I've got them all going across. So you can see all the playlists there, the different, the different topics, the meditations, EFT, um, my vlog and this this series to monetize the channel and then underneath yeah just all the videos and then just some old podcast episodes on my healing journey from ADHD so yeah so that's where we're at this week so let's hope we continue to grow in the right direction because I know that YouTube does like consistency and it's like any of the sort of social media the more people engage the more you get rewarded with um with views and being being exposed to potential viewers people who would be interested in, in your content yeah so that's uh week three of this journey to monetize my channel and um yeah well as ever i'll be back next week there'll be a new moon this coming week so there'll be a guided meditation for that because they tend to be more popular than the monday ones so um undecided still with the monday ones and eft continuing that series um for eyesight and also a vlog on wednesday so um yeah i feel like it's coming together now because and i'm getting more clarity and you, and it's good when the more people comment because that gives you ideas about what to talk about, what people are looking for and how I can help them. So please subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you again next week. And I will leave you with another shot of the sea. Take care. Go well. Lots of love. Bye.